The men and women of the 53rd Weather Reconnaissance Squadron at Keesler Air Force Base, Mississippi, have been keeping us prepared for bad weather since 1944. Their mission is to fly directly into the center of tropical storms and hurricanes and provide the most accurate storm tracking information possible. The data they send to the National Hurricane Center can increase weather forecast accuracy by 20%. This was extremely important in 2012, a year that had 19 named storms and 11 major hurricanes hurricanes, including the devastating Hurricane Sandy. Chief Master Sergeant Rick Cumbo, a lone master for the 53rd, explains how this data is collected and its importance to forecasters. Basically, the drops on operator on the plane, and uh, we'll basically use these drop zones. We'll drop these out of the bottom of the airplane, and they'll collect that as they fall. It'll collect the temperature. It's got a GPS sensor in there to collect the winds, to collect the pressure, and we'll drop these in various areas of the storm. Uh, to find out weather data. We're mainly concerned with, in, in a hurricane, the eye wall, this will give us the max winds, and also in the center of the storm, it gives us the pressures of the storm. That, I'll take that data, and the system will collect the data, I'll take and put the data into a weather format that the rest of the world can read. I'll QC it, send it over to the weather officer, and the weather officer will send it off to the hurricane center in Miami, and they actually make the forecast of where the storms are going. All the data I collect with the SONs, along with this vertical data, along with the horizontal data that I always collected, is, is vital to the forecasting of where the storm is going. Uh, if, if we can get good data into the models that predict where the storm is going, they're able to uh, reduce the, the, the evacuation area of the storms along the east coast. So you don't have to evacuate such a big area, you can concentrate on just a state or a couple of states. Well, I guess since I've lived on the coast my whole life, just coming out here and collecting the data and knowing that, that our data actually goes to good use, it, it helps in the forecasting these storms and evacuating and notifying people along the coast. It's, it's actually a good feeling to know you're doing something that counts.